guys, it's the Insane Kitten here. Um, I, I'm using a mirror in my phone because I'm going to do a makeup tutorial for you guys today. So, I have all this makeup right here. Sorry about the mess. Um, a lot of people ask me, you know, um, are your eyelashes fake or like, or anything like that. And I'm like, no, honestly, they're not. They're my real eyelashes. I just don't pluck them or anything, you know. Some people tend to pluck their eyelashes or, you know. Um, and mine are completely real. I mean, they're just long. And they look longer when I put mascara on. So... Usually the first thing I go with is the foundation powder. And then I'll, sorry guys, hold on. It looks a little dark when you put it on at first, but once you put, you know, the face shimmer and stuff like that, it's not as dark. Oh, hello. Okay. Well, once you put the face shimmer and everything on. It's not as dark. Sorry about this, guys. I'm using my phone. It's really difficult. Um, okay. So, first thing you want to do when doing your makeup is definitely wash your face. And then when you go to dry it, don't smudge, you pat dry it. Otherwise, you know, makeup won't stay on your skin as easily. So, you see, you go all around your face with this. And, you know, a lot of people are like, how do you do your makeup? Uh, blah, blah, blah. And I'm just like, well, you know, it's not that hard I mean I do I mostly do a simple look you know eyeliner you know and stuff like that so I don't do a very difficult look all right so I got this on I got the um powder crap on. <laughs> I usually don't put this on, but my face, I figured I might as well put it on, you know. Um, I got this powder stuff. It's the same thing, you know, practically the powder. But I just usually do this and then go around all over again, you know. It's a little bit lighter and everything, so you usually want to put these more on the highlight of your face. So, and I'm using a crappy camera, so yeah, you're not going to see it as much. But yeah, you want to put this more on the highlight of your face. I don't put on any blush because honestly, I think blush is useless. I mean, if you're really going to put blush on, then that's your choice, but, you know, that's just, that's not my choice. Um, I have a Rimmel London, got it for a dollar at the dollar store, you probably can't find it there anymore because it was a limited time thing, but I'm not going to use a Rimmel London today. Um, I'm going to use... Debut, something like that, because I want to go for more of a natural look with my eyes. Because I have blue eyes, and with blue eyes, it's harder to get the natural look out when you use um, darker colors or something. I don't know, but greens and then browns really bring out the blue if you have blue eyes 
I usually use the dark, darker stuff, but you know, that's me. But you'll want to go, hold on. You want to go through here because I'm using this brown right here. So oh god. I'm not used to this guys. <laughs> so you want to just put it on the lid, on the crease of the lid, on both eyes. So, yeah. <laughs> By the way, this thing, I don't know what you call it, I got it in a paintbrush set, so and I couldn't find any of these, um, so yeah, um, now I'm gonna go with the darker brown, okay, so, and put it along here. You might need to do it a couple times so it shows a little bit more, but I mean, the natural look is kind of what you want to go for, especially if you go to a job interview. I haven't really done a job interview yet, but... I plan on doing one soon, so I want to look as natural as possible, but yet professional. Um, and then, well, I'm not going to use a white in this because it's not as good, so I'm going to use the white in the Rimmel London to give a little bit of a highlight. around the edges. Like I said, you want to go with more of a natural look. And yes, I'm wearing a Lion King shirt. <laughs> but... There's the eyeshadow. Um, and then I usually do the eyeliner after because if you do it while before you do the eyeshadow, sometimes the eyeshadow gets all over it and it gets gross and it's like, eh. So let me open this real quick. I got brown eyeliner. Um, it's by LA Colors. And then I put it Eyelash line, yeah. Yeah, see? And then it gives you kind of a, no, natural look, but yet a little bit professional. 
Because you don't want to go too dark. And if you go too dark, you know, they might think differently about you. I mean, yeah, they want you to express yourself. But you know what? Society's screwed up, so... Usually I get to the mirror closer because, well, I usually don't have a phone in my hand. I u I'm usually listening to music while I'm doing my makeup. But, you know. But. And then there's that. And then I don't have brown eyeliner to go under, but I have black. I'm just gonna do it in the moon type thing. I don't know. Well, I'm gonna. Like this. Do the mascara if I can open it. <laughs> I got this, it was at a dollar store in the mall um, called Glitter when I was in Bradenton. But Um, they used to have it down here in Port Charlotte. I live near Port Charlotte, literally. It's like a five minute drive to Port Charlotte. But, um, you know, it's one of those things where, you know, they didn't get enough business or whatnot, so. All right, so I got this. It's actually my mom's, but she doesn't use it. It's called, it's Laurel Paris, uh, Volume Perfect. Um, the color is 610. So, all right, there's a base, as you can see. And you put it just like that. I usually don't do the base because, you know, I, I don't find use in it. But, yeah. And then this is the colors. Sorry, it's a little messy. My sister got it once. your lips usually gets the access off so it doesn't get on your teeth um, and then I got shimmer face shimmer 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 see shimmer 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 and you just wanna put it on your highlights Alright guys, this is the end of the tutorial, um, hope you like, uh, like, subscribe, yeah, see ya!